Today, the Austin City Council is set to meet with a lot on the table. And one thing in particular that is noteworthy worth mentioning, Austin police hiring situations and contract situations. Now, the reason we know they'll be talking about this is recent comments made by one of the council members. Austin Council Member Delia Garza wants the council to approve an employment contract with the Police Association, as well as calling on the council to support permanently appointing Brian Manley to chief of police. I feel that we've um, we've had we've had time to, you know, respectfully wait for the city manager to, to decide what he's going to do. But I think you know, even just hearing from the community this morning, I've just heard overwhelmingly um, take that interim out of, out of his name. Manley spoke to city council members on Tuesday to brief them on the recent bombings. Even before the bomber was caught, they were praising him for his hard work. Chief Manley, I just wanted to compliment you on your leadership through this process. Chief, I want to thank you and the manager for how well you've done putting out information for people. Folks are, are rightfully really nervous and scared. And former Austin Police Chief Art Acevedo actually came out himself in support of Manley, saying in part, quote, now let's remove that interim title and build the department, which is long overdue. And part of the reason Austin has gone so long without a permanent chief, the city has also been without a city manager for about as long as the city has been without a permanent chief. Now recently appointed city manager Spencer Cronk, he will ultimately make this decision, and he says expect to hear from him on the issue in the coming weeks and it can't go unnoticed along with removing this interim title the city council plans to make progress and hopefully establish an agreement on an Austin Police Association contract and in that deliberation as well.